Welcome. Today I want to show you how to export a joint so that you can design connection from StudPro to Idea Statica. So um, I'm having this connection here. I have a hanging mezzanine in this uh, warehouse and uh, StudPro uh, is not able to design this type of connection for me. So the type of connection that I'm getting is not going to work. As um, you can see. So I need this uh, connection here. Okay, let me just rotate it. I'm trying to uh, uh, show you why it is so important to incorporate a uh, idea statica. So this connection, my trust is the one which is supporting this um, a hanging a mezzanine. So this hanging mezzanine is pinned on this truss. So this connection is not uh, okay. So how do you export a model from Start Pro to uh, Idea Statica? So I will go to right click. So I will select geometry cursor and I will pick uh, this point. So let me just rotate it. Okay, I want to pick that joint using the geometry cursor. Then you need to go to utilities, user tool. If you have not configured idea, if you don't see idea statica here, it means you have not configured it. So you just need to go to configure and uh, make sure after you install idea statica, you configure it. Yes, you can see I have idea statica. That's why I can be able to find it in user two. And if I click it, my connection will be exported. Now this joint will be exported so that I can be able to um, design that uh, connection here in Idea Statica. Because you can see this one is pinned at this point and there is no other support. So this is the support. So this is pinned at and it's being supported by this truss. Okay, my, I have uh, exported my connection. So you need to click connections. So this one is the one I uh, exported previously, the one I just designed. So you, need, you make sure you click connections. So it's now being imported. So an error occurred during import. Um, and just maybe close this and do it again. Let me close these files. Close all these files. Uh, no problem. Because I'm through with uh, that uh, design. Okay, again, select, uh, you can either select node and then beam cursor. So you, you just need to make sure that both the node and the associated members have been selected. So I'll go to user two in utilities and select idea static. and make sure you click, because I'm importing connection, I'm not importing members. If you're importing members, then you click members.
So this is my connection. Then I can just open now the connection. If it's the previous connection, we already had done design. Now this one, um, you can now um, do your connection here. So I'm not uh, going to those details. That is how you uh, import this model, this uh, particular connection and members from start to to a DSTD card. So if you want to see how you can uh, do uh, that type of connection as um, um, you can see in these, then you have to watch my next video. You can see this connection, uh, the calculation, and you can also see I have the uh, I have the uh, detailing and drawing. Thanks for watching. Uh, we'll see you in my next video.